chill talking about uh, card games kind. Let's get this over with. Um, I love having Muta Generator there with nice looking animation. I'll have to go check out the Muta Generator um, with uh, with its animation in a bit because I'm not quite sure what it looks like. Anyway, let's focus. Otherwise, I run out of time. Uh, one man trap is probably enough. Hmm. I mean, I like these cards, but for later. Do I click it now? Uh, no. Well, I don't know what we've done to it. What do you think about games with chat? Uh, Scratch not has the night category. I know the truth. I find it very cute. I want you to admit it. Night. Oh yeah. <laughs> I see what you mean. Oh no, we're playing Nerf Guard and it's a assimilate deck. This is going to hurt my head. Right. I mean, I could just parasite that. But they'll have another one of these. Like, this isn't that good a card. Is it? It's not worth parasiting. Lock an enemy and damage it by three. I mean, I could just... I don't have a lava. Let's maybe put out a damsel. Probably some more important stuff. Yeah, probably. Let's put out a damsel. Or we should start with a drowner and just move it. I don't know. Drowner's useful later. Uh, fine. Do it. Um. No, only not the card faction of my nightmares. Young is the night. Uh, if neither player has passed and your opponent's hand is not full, they draw the lowest cost card and you draw the highest cost card. At least my lowest cost card is a decent version. But still, that's a nice card to play. Come on. Come on. Um, what am I coming to do? Oh, yeah. Well, I can play Thrive. Go on then. If you gave me that card, I'll play it. Thank you. Um, the Nilfgaard faction of your nightmares? The Yeah, the whole faction is nightmarish, I suppose. That was their ability to lock... But was it lock three? It doesn't say. That would be too useful. I thought it said it had three things it could lock. Lydia van Breedvoort. Cards are nightmares to deal with. Yeah, I mean, that's just Nilfgaard in a nutshell. Uh, create and play a special bronze card from your opponent's faction. So, create and play it. Did they? Bronze special card. What did they play? Oh, Red Riders. That's where the frost came from. I mean, they're both going to die. Unless I play Yig. Do I play Yig on that row? But then Yig will start taking the heat. Do I have a man trap? I do. I mean, do I care if they die? It's fine. Yig will go down to two health eventually. Or maybe I just pass in a second. Because I don't know in terms of card cost. Like, these weren't too expensive, these cards, and yet they seem very useful. Oh dear. Um, play a special card from your hand, then draw a card. Whenever you play a special card, giving give spying to a random non-spying enemy unit. Eat it. Do I have my toad? Or are you talking about eating this? I should probably eat this. Um, although it doesn't trigger Thrive nicely. Or I could just Parasite it. Come on. I'm assuming you mean to eat the Yig, otherwise Come we on. use the Lug. The Yig. Lose the Yig. This, um... No, God, guy doesn't like me. No Yig. And... Work for free. 
So, pass. Destroy an enemy unit with nine or more power, which they did. Destroy an enemy witcher. Ten, and how much is a yig? Twelve or something? Ten. Okay, so it was a fair exchange. I say we pass. Twenty points down. Right, having the lock against Nilfgaard sounds very useful. Um, we need to win this round. They might go for a short round, though. So we do have two Thrive units, that's good, so that's happy. Fiend, yeah, but maybe there's something better. Spear could also be useful, but I've got that. Um... What's important to get that guy out now, oh, annoying later? Uh, well, that was a great swap. The Necker Warrior for the Necker Warrior. Time to get our hands dirty. We say important to get that guy out. Which guy out? Oh, the um, one of their cards. Like this guy. I see what you're saying. Uh, deploy. Reveal the top card from your opponent's deck and banish it. Do I know what what, what got banished? Anyway, I'll try and work that out in a second. Come on. He really doesn't like me. Am I? Is this going to be a long round or a short round? I need more provision from opponent in round one more. Um. Come on. Um, I just, I don't know if I should be playing Scenario. Come on. Like, it's my whole game. I think I have to. And then expect him to pass very soon. Fiend got banished. Okay. Thanks again, Mia. <laughs> You're the one who's paying attention. Destroy an enemy unit. Then your opponent summons the top unit from their deck to a random enemy row. Oh no, is it Mill? Play Lava. Looks bad. I mean, I'm just going for playing the game in terms of... I've put down my mana, so... Sure. I mean, it definitely doesn't look good, put it that way. Decoy. And if I insert a needle here, what then? Lava ranged. And there maybe is a delay on things. Um I suppose ranged to get the Sabbath stuff going. It's fine, because they'll find a way to kill that. It's Mel, he's going to remove as many cards from your deck as possible so you won't ha be able to play them. Okay. Well, it's going to lead to a painful round then. I guess we just play Damsel. No, you're an idiot. Why? Oh, I just... I need to um, pay more attention sometimes. I had the mana out, so I needed to not play the other Thrive card. There we go. Well, it wouldn't have worked out for Koshi anyway, but still. So I guess it wasn't too bad a mistake. Um. Right, you can bring back Yig. Cat and Koshi can work together. Toad, useful. Oh yeah, you said it earlier. Having lock against Nilfgaard is useful, meanwhile they have 10 locks. locks. Hmm. Um, but still, I think it's useful. Toad is probably useful. 
to kill one of their things. Um, but it's all useful. What? Um, okay, that's still useful as well. Show cards. You can't make the noise while saying opponent's connection lost. I know that. Well, that was a terrible move. I should have kept that card. <sighs> Come on. Right, what are we trying to do? Start with lava. That's what we're trying to do. Um good mill deck sometimes can be so annoying that you won't be able to even draw three cards in a round. Three. I see. Shuffle a card from your graveyard into your deck. Okay. Um, we don't have much Thrive going on. Because I moved it away. Cat will be blocked as soon as you play it. It's command. Koshai will be destroyed in the very next turn. Come on. So I shouldn't play cat now. Come on. Right, he has locks. I've just shown him that I have like, something that's worth locking. Um, play cat, but save its immunity. No click. Okay. So we are not going to click the cat. Do we click it when we play Koshi? And then it will be locked after that? Or do we just not click it and we just let their things thrive us? And we don't have a lot of thrive going on here anyway. Um, do I eat their Witch Apprentice? Maybe it isn't worth it just yet. Um, the Toad's best food is a pig, no doubt. I just wasn't sure if something more annoying would come up later, because this isn't annoying until they have another 15 points. And maybe I play my own one now, but it doesn't really matter, I suppose. It's fine. You're saying it's a good idea. I'm assuming when you say a good idea, you mean to play it now rather than later. If you're saying it's a good idea to save it, then, you know, I'm sorry. <laughs> this is what happens when you're a noob. It it's a good idea to get it. It's a good idea to wait for it. I think it's a good idea all around, as long as we're thinking about our toad. Uh, create and play a unit from your opponent's starting deck. And he somehow decided to create the cat. I have no idea what's about to show up, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, that's the game. <laughs> you don't know what's happening. Uh, in terms of their cars being hidden. They didn't have any Thrive, but he can still just keep boosting it. I mean, I could lock it if I wanted to. Is it worth locking? His cat will be boosting your unit, so... Ah. I like it. I mean, only these two, but still. Um, let's go with our witch, then. Quick, move those hooves. Just enough back. points as well. And locked. But it means he can't lock both the cat and Koshi. Uh, click the cat with Koshi. That's the only option. Both cards will be destroyed. Kill his cat like a parasite. Love card. When your own card starts to play against you. Hmm. Uh, damage self by two. Then lock all units in your opponent's hand until the end of the round. What? So if I if I play Dorograi on him, would all this unlock? They're all locked already. I can't. Would it work if I lock him? Next time your opponent plays a locked unit, remove lock from all units in your opponent's hand. Our world is in harmony. I don't know what's happened.
kill his comp. No, you have to play one lock card now and the rest will unlock. Um, okay, so that one, therefore, is gone. Uh, so we're going to do our Koshi stuff. And you're saying to kill his cat. And I'm sorry that I didn't kill his cat. There were other things going on. Um, I can remove it with the heat wave. But for now, we're going to do Koshi. And we're going to click the cat. And we're going to force of nature. No need to kill the cat. I mean, there's a... Uh, I guess the difference between... What benefits it giving him versus what benefits giving me. It seems like it's... Benefiting me. Because it's thriving... Koshi as well. And for some reason he has locked my cat rather than Koshi. Um, in terms of Oz... Wait, Nagulfar. Who have we got? Morvid. Okay, so we've got Morvid to pull out with that. In terms of Oz, we can Yig. It's a question of, do we want to get rid of this guy? I mean, you can use his cat for your advantage with your cat's passive. Oh, it, but he's now locked, so it's not going to be... Um, so I should get rid of his cat now. Because my cat has been locked, so... Just heatwave the cat now. Yeah. It, unless there was a way to... If I had Purify, that might be a good idea. What was that? Just remove a, move an enemy unit to the top of your deck. Really? But I boosted it and everything. Um, well, we can still trigger our own Thrive. Let's do that now. The, do they have anything better? No. Dr. Shu is saying that I'm going to win. Oh, Again. It's, it's always early, but it's not looking bad. Who's this guy? Master Mirror. Um, transform the leftmost card in your hand to a random legendary card from your faction that was not in your starting deck. Repeat this ability whenever you play the rightmost card from your hand. It's Nilfgaard, when your own cards... Yeah, I mean... He's definitely using my cards. But it's the top of the deck, so he isn't actually going to play it. As far as I'm concerned, this is also a Nilfgaard tactic to uh, ruin your connection. <laughs> you think he ult f would and then I won. I mean... I apologise to this person if I'm slow at the game, but if this is what they have done, then... Which is what they have done. It's what very angry opponents do to waste your time. Your opponent's connection was lost and they were forced to forfeit. You have won the game. Well, then we do not give them the GG, because even though the game itself was good and I was enjoying it, the manner in which they left the game was not good, so... No GG, but also GG. Anyway, I almost clicked it there. Um, see this is... Oh, that's Journey. I've only got two bonus left on my Journey as well, so I need to change that. Was, it, was that Journey? What? What is that challenge? Um, we unlocked... We, we did our Summer Cycle challenge. 
which was the spawning units with our um, Wave the Witcher. So we now unlock Medium, which is... I mean, it would be nice if we just unlocked that from the start. For us noobs who can't do this stuff. Um, play 20 humans from Crimson Curse. I don't know... Can I re-roll these, or do I have to play... No, I have to pay resources. It's like, I'm not going to play Syndicate cards or Skellige cards. Um, but humans... I may play humans. Uh, yep, yeah, Filth Guard players are known to be toxic. No GG for Nilf Guard. Oh, you unlocked medium quests. I have. Only one of them is maybe useful, though. Um, if we go look at our deck, Crimson Curse. Crimson. Curse. Do I have any Crimson Curse for a start? Uh, I'm sure you know which one is which, but I do not. Are there any humans in it at all? Um, no. Yes, the Fisher King. Um, if you deploy him onto the ranged row, he can move any card from your deck to the top. Is that useful? Would we play it temporarily in place of a spear? Just to do the quest? How many times do we have to do it? 20 times. We'd have to play 20 games with this guy in our deck. Is it worth it? You can fit him instead of something. Yeah, maybe, but... Like I say, just with the same number of points the, out of these three... Oh, sorry, four. Um, Parasite, Dorograi, Mastercraft, Spear, or Andrega Lava. I mean, that's why I went for the Spear, because the Lava are very useful for me. Having the Lock is why we have Dorograi there in the first place. We don't have to have him. We could make our Nagulfar better. But as well, I have to do it 20 times. Keep looking. Play it 20 times. So not just have it in the deck for 20 games, but to use it 20 times. I mean, sure. Is it good? No. If he's ruining our games, then we'll remove him again. I don't know. These... I feel like these quests are definitely designed for the people who have got all the cards and want to change up their deck and do weird things, or like, you know, they have a Skellige deck and they have Syndicate and they just want to like, oh yeah, I should play my Skellige deck today. But for someone like me, who's got one decent deck, <laughs> um, it doesn't really help. And I'm the one who needs the things like chests and scraps. Not you seasoned pros over there. Anyway, party continues. Play another game. We can watch our knight play with his balls. Sorry, ball singular. Eyeball. Singular. Um... Where are all the worthy worthy rivals? That's what I want to know. I mean, they can, can give you some small rewards for just playing. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then please leave a like. And if you think you would enjoy more, then please subscribe or even join me live on Twitch. Whilst it's cliche, all of these will help the channel. On screen is something carefully curated or something the YouTube algorithm suggests, or maybe even both. In any case, have a great day.